Okay, hey Taurus, so this is going to be a general reading. I'm getting something in regards to you feeling clear. That's what I'm getting, Taurus. Like the birds are chirping, you're happy, you feel clear, you have clarity. Things are working out for you. You know things are always working out for you as well. That's what I'm getting. You're very optimistic. You're staying positive here. That's what I'm getting. You're happy. What's going on here with Taurus? What's going on here with Taurus? Wow, that's too many. Somebody could be, yeah, somebody is, you have a lot coming in for you. That's what I'm getting. A lot of people are going to want to work with you. A lot of people are going to want to collaborate with you here. That's what I'm getting. I'm hearing after a period of like being stagnant, a lot of people are going to want to work with you. So it's like important that you're mindful in regards to your time. Like you balance your time here or you use your time wisely. I'm also getting you are going to have a lot going on for you here. Definitely in this month. A lot of like new changes this month. So be mindful in regards to your energy here. Your energy levels. Make sure you get rest. Yep. I'm telling you, make sure you get rest. Make sure you're balanced here. Something in regards to your electrolytes here is significant as well. I'm getting something in regards to like new opportunities. I'm also hearing like winning. You could be winning some type of award or some type of achievement here. Or like you're recovering in regards to some type of competition. You could have won some type of award here. But it's like important that you're mindful in regards to your energy here. What's going on here with Taurus? So you're receiving good karma here. I'm also getting somebody finding out that you are leveling up is like stressing another person out. Whoever this individual is, somebody this could be somebody that like wishes they would have worked with you here. But somebody is seeing that you are this queen of pentacles here. You are this empress. It's also a lot of conversation. Like a lot of people are watching you or watching something that you're doing here. You could be on some type of uh, podium or platform here as well. That's what I'm getting. But somebody is like watching you here. You could also be like holding something. Holding some type of uh, award or cup or something like that here. So you're on a podium. You're holding some type of cup. That's what I'm getting. And somebody is like upset in regards to this here or shocked. Somebody is shocked here. You like did a whole like shift. That's what I'm getting. I'm also getting something in regards to like a stick shift could be significant. That's not going to be for everyone. But you did a shift or a transformation here. And somebody is like wishing they would have partnered up with you or something like that here. What's going on here with Taurus? Yep. What's going on here with Taurus? This person is like constantly thinking about you here. Yep. Somebody sees that you are confident here as well. Somebody is constantly thinking about you here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody sees that you level up. Somebody is also like in awe of your confidence. Somebody like admires your confidence. This could be somebody that's like a rival, but I'm not getting that this person is like malicious or anything like that. Somebody admires how confident you are. Somebody sees that you are growing here. That's what I'm getting. Or somebody sees something taken off for you. I'm really getting something in regards to like, wow. Something in regards to driving is significant. Something in regards to like a track. I picked that energy up in a previous reading that I did for you here, Taurus. So somebody could definitely do something in regards to like professional driving here or something like that. Or somebody drives fast, but somebody admires your confidence and somebody sees like you're moving forward. You're very successful here. And it's because like you found a new like zest for something that you're doing here or you're very passionate here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody could be wanting to make you some type of offer, but this could be somebody that left you on the cold and this person feels like a fool for doing that. 
somebody feels like a fool for like not making you an offer here. I'm also getting like some slow down for you for a short period of time, but it's going to pick back up. Or somebody is going to want to like go into some type of business partnership with you or you are getting a new opportunity. You are getting a new opportunity here. That's what I'm getting. And you're going to be very successful here moving forward. And somebody is like wishing that they would have worked with you or something like that here. Or they would have been patient. Somebody wishes they would have been patient with you and like trusted you or trusted the process here. This person also didn't support you. Somebody feels like they didn't support you when they should have. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is in regret. Like, yeah. Somebody is in regret here. Yeah, somebody is going to come in and express their love to you here as well. Or show you support. What's going on here with Taurus? Yep, I'm telling you, you're a very, very like optimistic person. Even when things are going wrong, you still find a way to see the positive in the situation here. And that's because you let go of the situation here. You surrender. Now you are trusting the process. You know things are always working out for you, even when it seems like it's not. Even when it's something that you feel like is a struggle or an obstacle, you still see the positive in every situation around you. That's helping you move forward. That's helping you become this empress and this queen of pentacles. I could be speaking to a male or a female, but you're standing in your power here. That's what I'm getting. What's going on here with Taurus? And somebody admires your confidence. You have somebody that admires your confidence or you have somebody that admires the fact that when everything is going against you, you still find a way to see the positive in the situation here and you are leveling up. Yep. Look here. For some, this could be like a secret admirer here. Yeah. You're doing the healing work. You're taking your power back, but you have somebody that's like very, somebody feels very inspired by you here as well. You have a lot of people in your energy here. You have somebody that's like very inspired by you, but this person could have like a, maybe a competitive side. I'm getting something in regards to like a competitive side here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, somebody, you have a secret, you definitely have a secret admirer here. That's what I'm getting. But you are focusing on yourself. This could be somebody that you have not met yet. I'm getting something in regards to somebody being like, I'm here competitive, but this could be in regards to this person like having a crush on you or somebody is wanting to link up with you here or something like that. I'm also getting this person is like in awe of why like, Somebody feels like you are like a hidden gem or something like that. Like a diamond. Somebody feels like you are very precious to them. Somebody feels like somebody is thankful that like you are single here or something. So somebody knows that you are single. Somebody is wanting to reach out to you here. Whoever this individual is like, this person feels like anybody that you were dealing with here in the past was playing games. But this person, whoever this individual is, this person has a lot of love for you. That's what I'm getting. Yeah. This person, this person admires you here. I'm telling you. And this is, this could come at a shock for you here as well. That's what I'm getting here, Taurus. This person is also very, very romantic. Somebody is very, very romantic. Yeah. And whoever this person, yeah, definitely with this romantic feelings. Somebody admires the fact that, like, you love yourself here as well. Somebody admires the fact that, like, you have boundaries here. You're very mindful in regards to your energy here. You're very mindful in regards to who you allow in your energy here as well. Somebody knows that you love yourself here as well. That's what I'm getting. Somebody admires the fact that you love, respect yourself here as well. I'm also getting whoever this individual is, they admire the fact that like you aren't willing to like sell out or like do anything low vibrational to get a relationship because you love yourself here. That's what I'm getting. And somebody admires that about you here. That's what I'm getting. Yep. 
whoever this individual is, this person could be moving away from somebody from their past. And this person is trying to trust the process here. Somebody is wanting to link up with you. And this could end in a higher level of commitment here. Some could end in a higher level of commitment. I'm also getting like your divine counterpart is not the person that you thought it was. This could be a high level soulmate coming in for you. But like you could have been waiting on somebody else or you thought somebody else was like your divine counterpart here. You have a high level soulmate coming in for you. I'm also getting your divine counterpart could have did something shady to you here in the past. And like you let go of the situation. Well, because you let go of that, now you are about to link up with a high level soulmate here. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, somebody is like releasing their ex. Whoever this individual is, this person, wow. This person is working on releasing somebody from their past here. Could be somebody that they had a lot of love for here as well. This person could have been betrayed by this ex here as well. That's not going to be for everyone. Whoever this individual is, this person is an empath. This person, this is a masculine energy, could be a feminine energy, but this person is very sensual. This person is very romantic. That's what I'm getting. I'm getting like this person has a way of connecting with you that does not involve sleeping together or this person feels like that about you. That's what I'm getting. Yeah. You are going to vibe well with this person yeah it's something in regards to like communication could be significant here as well but you are going to vibe well with this individual here i'm also getting something in regards to 33 could be significant or the third could be significant or six could be significant yep you are definitely going to vibe with this person this person came across you i'm getting like somebody came across you in a note or a love note, something in regards to a love note or a note. I'm also hearing a notation or a letterhead or something like that. Or a quote, or I'm hearing a quoted story or something like that here. Something in regards to a quote. Or maybe you could be a poet here. Or you're a very inspirational individual here. Yeah, we have golden children, inner child, tenderness, innocence, rare gifts. I'm also getting like you are very like you're spiritually high ranking, but you're very intuitive here. You're very like creative It's something in regards to your energy here as well It's very like vibrant here. I'm also getting something in regards to colors or palettes or a color palette or a spectrum of colors or something in regards to the spectrum here is significant as well. Yep, you could be a boss, you could be a business owner, you could be, wow, you could be on the spectrum, but you're a business owner. I'm also getting something in regards to speech apraxia, and that could like, at times have you feeling like you're constantly judging yourself in regards to that, but you are going to communicate well with this person or people understand you, like your soul tribe is coming in for you, people that receive you, that are open to receiving you that are not judging you and criticizing you. So be open with yourself here as well. Yep. We have lifting the veil, questioning everything. Anything unaligned must go. So yeah, you're constantly judging yourself here. You're also very skilled, but you're constantly judging yourself here. That's what I'm getting. And it's causing you to like hold back. Yeah, you definitely could have speech apraxia, but when it comes to speech apraxia, my advice is just screw it. Just push forward. Like, you get insecure about it but like it is what it is some things you have to learn to like adapt to and in time it can improve you can get speech therapy and stuff for it but i definitely understand so yeah but somebody is like in awe of you and you're constantly questioning yourself that's what i'm getting i'm also getting you could have been bullied in regards to your speech or speech apraxia in the past like, it's very frustrating. I definitely get it. I can definitely relate. Yeah, we have the great severing, Mars energy, angel conflict, softening to love. Yeah. You could have been up in your head here in the past or you were constantly judging yourself. It's important that you stop, like, being so hard on yourself here. That's what I'm getting. Stop being so hard on yourself here, Taurus yep wow 
I'm also getting some that you deal with could be in regards to your speech. Yeah, you're going to be able to help people take their power back and move forward. So you could be encouraging people to embrace that. If you have a speech impediment here or something like that, you could be encouraging people to embrace and be their true authentic self. Yeah, because I know my apraxia catches me up a lot, a lot. And I will, I constantly like criticize myself. That's why I say I can relate to this. So if this is something that you are dealing with here, you are meant to help other people. That's what I'm getting by being your true authentic self. People are going to judge you. People are always going to have something to say. It is what it is. Move forward. But you have somebody that's watching you here. And it's a secret admirer here that you have that's watching you. Maybe this person could deal with the same thing. But whoever this individual is, this person understands you. This person gets you. And this person has a lot of love for you. And somebody is like currently closing out a karmic cycle with somebody from their past. And whoever this individual is, they want to link up with you. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. Yeah. You have new love coming in for you here. And this is a, a soulmate that you are dealing with. This could be somebody that you linked up with here in a past life here as well. This is a high level soulmate. Yeah, you had somebody bullying you in regards to how you talk or something like that. Just let it go. Just let go. Let it go and let go here, Taurus. And be your true authentic self. And watch how fast your soul tribe gravitates towards you here. Yeah, but I'm in it there, Taurus. Best of luck with this situation if this is you dealing with this or somebody around you.